The Mangalorean Catholic cuisine is the cuisine of the Mangalorean Catholic community and is largely influenced by Mangalorean, Goan, and Portuguese cuisines. Mangalorean Catholics are Roman Catholics from Mangalore and the former South Kanara district on the southwestern coast of India. They are Konkani people and speak the Konkani language. Most of the ancestors of Mangalorean Catholics were Goan Catholics, who had migrated to South Kanara from Goa, a state north of Kanara, between 1560 and 1763 during the Goa Inquisition and the Portuguese Maratha Wars. The culture of Mangalorean Catholics is a blend of Mangalorean and Goan cultures. After migration, they adopted the local Mangalorean culture but retained many of their Goan customs and traditions. Non-vegetarian cuisine Their curry uses a lot of coconut and curry leaves while ginger, garlic and chili are also used. Mangalorean Catholic cuisine has distinct Portuguese influence as can be seen in Liteo, the famous pork roast served as the pièce de résistance at wedding dinners, and pork sorpatel. Fabled cooks like David Am or Alisabai were called in to help with the repast. Mangalorean Catholics mix pork blood and other parts in most of their pork delicacies as can be seen from pork bifat, cabadella and calis un kiti heart and intestines. Sana dukra mas sana, idli fluffed with toddy or yeast, dukra mas pork and un dukra mas und, leavened bread, dukra mas pork are popular dishes. Chicken indaz is also popular. The traditional rosachi kadi rose curry, a fish curry made with rose coconut milk is quite popular and is served during the rose anointing ceremony that is held one or two days before a Mangalorean Catholic wedding. Their fish curry especially their fish roe curry, is known for its taste in the whole of coastal India while fried fish in their style is well known. The shevio rose and pathal bakri a variant of kori rati are dry rice flakes dipped in chicken gravy dishes. Vegetarian cuisine The Balthazar chutney is a popular condiment. The dish originated when Balthazar, a Mangalorean Catholic nobleman, was taken prisoner by Tipu Sultan in 1784 during the captivity of Mangalorean Catholics at Seringapatam. Unable to stomach the indifferent camp food, he offered to make a chutney for the captured Mangalorean Catholics. The palu, a type of sambar with galmbi powdered dried fish or kambulmas dried tuna is popular. The traditional food is a popular pickle. Tile piao, which means literally vegetables dumped with oil and onions and left to boil on the fire wood is quite popular. Karam cucumber salad and foka ladies finger combined with cashinets. The appam rice balls and panpol a type of pancake are popular delicacies made of soaked rice, water and salt. The thath bakri is a banana leaf rice dish made with ground red boiled rice mixed with raw scraped coconut and roasted on a tava on a banana leaf. The mite, mandas, yushe, piti and mani are well-known sweet dishes. Kuswar is a term often used to mention a set of unique Christmas goodies which are part of the cuisine of the Mangalorean Catholic community There are as many as 22 different traditional recipes that form this distinct flavor of Christmas celebration in Mangalore. Nuris are puffs stuffed with plums, nuts, and fried thiel sesame, and sugar. Kidya or kulkuls are curly concoctions dipped in sugar treacle. Pathekas are savory of green nandarkai bananas, thiel ladus and jaw snapping golios. Macaroons is what Mangalore is famous for and the subtle flavored rose cookies are a hot favorite. But it is the rich plum cake which takes the better part of a week to make. Candied fruit, plums, currants, raisins are dexterously cut and soaked in rum. Flour sieved and gently warmed in the sun. Nuts shelled and chopped and the whole family comes together to make the cake. Jobs are allotted, one to whip up the eggs, while another creams the butter and sugar, cake tins are lined, and a strong pair of arms requisitioned to do the final mixing and stirring. Patrode or patrade, a dish of colocasia leaves stuffed with rice, dal, jaggery, coconut, and spices is also popular. The Mangalorean Catholic version of this steamed delicacy is a slight variation on the Tuluva recipe. More spicy, it is fried in meat mersing, salt and chili, a red chili masala, which is a popular condiment used to flavor Mangalorean Catholic dishes. Topic notes.
Topic: External links. Mangalorean Catholic cuisine by Rosemary Albuquerque Pie from the Summer Sands online newspaper. Mangalorean cuisine by My Nation easy recipes and dishes.